Hey guys, so this is my third video on the little Hanes V146C. Um, I'm just doing a tear down on the inside, taking the seats and the carpet and whatnot out. I've already taken gauges and a 75 Mercury, but I couldn't get that in the video just because someone called me up and bought the Mercury and it, yeah, it all happened at once. But um, I'm on to sanding and I'll just let you guys go through the footage. It's hot today. It is hot. So I'm up to sanding the hull. This is going to be a bit of a job. I'm um, using the Orbital. I'll be using 80 grit and then working my way up to 120. Um, mainly focusing on the anchor well and the breaker just to get all that filler flat and smooth. But I'll also be sanding the entire top deck of the hull, filling any holes and yeah, just getting it ready for paint. I'm just removing the bolts from the previous motor. It was a 75 two-stroke Mercury. It was a big donk of a thing. Um, I didn't want to keep that motor on the boat, so I was happy when I sold it. And yeah, I didn't get to take the footage of, uh, of the motor coming off because the bloke literally showed up at my house, but um, like without knowing. But yeah, I was happy he took the motor. Have a look at this fucked corner that I'm getting in. Get that out, huh? Yeah, the top deck's been sanded. I'm up to painting, um, which I'm stoked about. I got the Norglass product. It's a really hard wearing epoxy paint. It's a two pack. Um, I'm gonna apply the white undercoat first and then obviously the top coat, the last white over the top. I'm just taping the boat up, uh, making sure any rubbers or anything are covered that I don't wanna get paint on. And yeah, I'll be rolling this boat. I definitely prefer to use a spray gun. I've used that in the past, but as you can see, I'm on the street. So I'm just working with what I got. first coat on the Hanes and as you can see the top deck has a fair few contours and different lines so it's very important to get the roller right in there cover all surfaces and yeah you might have to roll it out three or four times in one spot just to get the coverage you're after but uh, the end result speaks for itself
there it is, the top deck of the Haynes is painted. Um, for, a, for a street job with a roller, I was pretty stoked with how it turned out. Probably dust kicking up all over it, but um, as you can see, it doesn't look too bad. Now I'm excited to get onto some fun stuff, fitting the motor, fitting a couple other bits and pieces, so yeah, stay tuned.